Hello everybody, welcome to Pebble Beach. Today is the 2021 Pebble Beach Concorde d'Elegance. If I zoom up in here, see the lodge up there. And all the cars are arriving, so I'm gonna do this one take. I don't quite know what I'm gonna run into and how professional this will be, but I'm just gonna do a bit of a quick field tour. Now to my right here, we have 13 Porsche 917, some from Germany, many really cool cars. We'll have a quick look at those. Cars are rolling in. We have Best of Show Mercedes here, a Selchik Mercedes. Absolutely stunning and incredible. Look at that. Beautiful French coach work. Cars are rolling. We got an Allard here. I believe this Allard was a Pell Beach Road Races overall winner. Pretty amazing. We have nine, the 917 class here. These cars were set up last night, so that's why some of them are covered up. We have C2 Golf 917Ks here. Pretty amazing sight today at Pebble Beach. Now, if we look in the distance, there's an ESO Revolta class. And if I go way up, there's a Countach class over there. Got some early American stuff rolling in. Not sure. Some antique car here, Brass Era. Look at that. Holy moly, we got a lineup coming in. Gonna have a look over this way. I think this is a Ferrari 750 Monza. Another Pell Beach Road Race overall winner. Look at the real estate here. Custom body Pininfarina Ferrari. The first, the first Pininfarina body Ferrari. Sorry, this mods is really loud. Great looking thing. Just keep going down the line. You couldn't hear me earlier. This is the first Pininfarina body Ferrari. Beautiful Bentley, custom coachwork, I believe. Maybe Park Ward, I'm gonna guess. That's pretty amazing. Wow, look at this Rolls Royce skiff. Whoa, that's pretty impressive. Love the lines on that, the contrast, everything about that. Oh man, have a look at this. <laughs> that is absolutely amazing, Delage. Oh, look at the lines on that. This is a Pebble Beach car through and through. Wow. Holy, look at that's quite the fastback. We thought the E-Type was a fastback. Have a look at this. Wow. Okay, so let's sneak onto the show field here. See what we can find. <laughs> There's goodness everywhere, look at this. Yeah, welcome to Pebble Beach. So this is a Pininfarina class. It's a Pininfarina bodied Lancia. I love the lines on it, the grill. That's really neat. And we got a Ferrari by Pininfarina class. So these are custom bodied Pininfarina Ferraris. Get out of the way here. Oh wow, so this is the three seater Ferrari, kind of the inspiration for the McLaren F1. It's been refurbished recently by Michael, by Paul Russell, sorry. But you see that steer mill's right in the middle with two seats on either side. Very, very cool and unique car. I think that's called a Coupe Aerodynamico on a 250 chassis. And that's the first Ferrari Cabriolet Series 1 prototype. See the cut down on the door, kind of like a TR3? Very neat car. Okay, let's go around and see what we can find. It's a 10 minute tour of Pebble Beach. So we have another Pininfarina Ferrari class, an early Pininfarina Ferrari class here. And an absolutely amazing lineup on the waterfront here at Pebble Beach. 
I really like this 375. I think it's a 375. Has a very unusual grill treatment. And I don't know if you could tell on camera, but the green on the burgundy is just phenomenal. And just have a peek over here. This is one of the only Ferrari with wings. It's called the Super Fast. It's from the Robert Lee collection. Right on. Oh yeah, you can see this Ferrari from the back. It has this great sail. I think there's a sail panel at the back here. Keep on going down. Okay, so I know a little bit more about this car that I showed everybody from yesterday. It's a 275 that was custom made by Batista fin Pininfarina for himself and kind of showcase maybe some of the design directions they might take with the car. This is an absolute stunner. The color, everything about it. I think there's over 50 unique details on this car. Recently restored, totally amazing. I'm gonna have to have a look at the front end because I, I'm just in love with this one. Ha, we see that Delage rolling in again. Have a look at that. Look at the lines on that. Is there anything more elegant? Is there anything more elegant than that? I'm not sure. All right, keep going. Hi, Rob. Good morning. Okay, we got a Pininfarina bodied Mercedes. How unusual. There's so much Pininfarina here this year. This is absolutely awesome. Some Ferrari Grand Tours. This is neat. It's a Dino, but it's an aluminum body Dino called a 206 GT. Slightly different here and there. Oh man, competition Ferraris out in full force. Look at this 512. We have a Ferrari 250 GTO, 64 body, 1964 configuration, sorry. Uh, yeah, that's a pretty desirable car. Isn't that amazing? Whoa. Then we got a Tour de France beside that. In a Tour de France livery. I think this is a big Ferrari 340 from 52. I just love the headlight covers on this thing. Let's have a quick look. <laughs> the Ferrari badge is painted over. Look at that. Then where it started all with Ferrari, the 166 Barchetta. I had a look at this car earlier. It's what you call a Lusso specification Barchetta. You see the cockpit trimming here? Oh man, it's so simple and elegant, the Bakelite knobs and whatnot. You have a pretty amazing display of competition Ferraris here. Look at that. Okay, let's keep going down. I see a Jaguar. Let's go check out this Jaguar. Aston Martin DB5 convertible. Look at this Jaguar C-Type, everybody. Yes, I found it. An awesome Jaguar here at Pebble Beach. How about that? Holy moly. Look at this. Simply awesome. See the Sandcast carburetors here. Wow. Very cool. See where their inspiration came from the E-Type. I see the engine sum frames in there. Flip front, of course. Nice, simple interior. Okay, more Ferraris, more the Carrera Panamericana class. Wow, this is really something special. Oh, I like this Ferrari. It's a really odd body. Three, it's called a 340 Mexico with Vignale bodywork. Very unusual fender treatment. Just love that. Uh, oh, there's E-Type. E-Type here at Pebble Beach. Wow. So it's a 61 fixed head. Look at that. Looks like opalescent, dark green. Amazing. Let's have a look at the interior. Yeah. 
Yeah, it looks like a really early one with the small little dash top there. Awesome. And a Mercedes. Now, I was talking to the guy from Mercedes-Benz Classic, and what's really cool about this Mercedes, although we can't see it right now in the sunlight, they painted it nitrocellulose metallic. It's a new process they're providing to their customers to give the right finish of the paint that it had in the 1950s, which is pretty amazing. In the sun, it really shows it off. It's kind of like this semi-gloss. Maserati A6G. Love the design on these. This one was restored by my friends at RX in Vancouver. So kind of a hometown car. The grill's really amazing. Okay, in behind here, I'll just sweep. These are all the previous best of show winners here at Pebble Beach. And this is why I just had to be here this year. So many amazing cars. And all just showstoppers in their own rights. I mean, look at this Talbot Lego. I call it a teardrop design. Pretty amazing. I don't think there's a straight line on that car. And that contrast with this Voisin, a French car of an unusual design and proportions. It really has the most amazing interior. And now here we go. This is the Type 57 Bugatti Atlantic. One of, I think, only three in the world. Uh, amazing fastback design from 1934, I believe. And the design has really neat feature where there's kind of a riveted flange on the fenders and all the way down the center of the car. It is truly spectacular. A real Pebble Beach car. And next to that, oh man, Alfa Romeo 8C2900 Lungo, touring Berlinetta, supercar of its day. Wow, this combo, this pairing is absolutely sensational. I can't stop recording. I mean, these cars are so amazing. Look at, so yeah, these fastbacks, this is where the E-Type got the shape for the fastback design here, from cars like this in the 30s. Yeah, wonderful day here at Pebble Beach. Keep going down the line. Okay, we got another Alfa Romeo 8C touring Berlinetta. Look at that. Look at the shape of that. This one's a little more unique because you see it has the louvers. They go all the way past the hood into the cowl. The cutouts on the rear wheel cover there. Wow, such amazing cars. And here we go, a special bodied Scaglietti Ferrari 375 that won, I think, five years ago. Oh man, the design on that's just amazing. It really looks like kind of a more performance oriented Mercedes 300 SL. You see the sign here Best of Show Reunion. All right, well, there we go. Look at that. <laughs> Look at all these best of show winners from Pella Beach. And I think on that note, I got to end this video. So thanks for watching, everybody. So happy to be here at Pella Beach. And hopefully I'll be able to make a, a bit more videos for you in the future on this show. See you later, everybody. Bye-bye.